morning late again. Um, I overslept because I went to sleep like half to, I don't know, 3 a.m. And yeah, my class has already started like almost 10 minutes ago and I'm just leaving my house, but it's fine. I feel like I'm having a breakdown over typography in every single one of my weekly vlogs but I actually just... I don't know. I have three monograms and three triplexes due midnight and I'm going to be home like at 9 p.m. because now I'm going to work and then I have this, I don't know, lecture meeting something with Tim Allen, the animator uh, which even if I wouldn't want to go, which I do, um, I it's it's mandatory, so I have to go. Um, yeah, and then I have just three hours to finish the task, and I still need to come up with one monogram design and correct the one triplex design that I have because the teachers did not accept my idea yesterday. Um, yeah, and basically I just I'm over it. I. I had enough. <laughs> nine I'm home. The lecture by Tim Allen was pretty fun. He showed us everything from the animatic through the live action videos and behind the scenes and the final scenes from the movies and it was really cool to see how the real animator actually works but it was a really long lecture it was over two hours long and that's why I'm home this late. Now I'm just gonna work on the typography assignment, I guess. And then I also wanted to finish my 2D animation for tomorrow. But I'm not sure whether I'm going to manage to do that because I don't want to go to sleep as late as I did yesterday because my head was hurting all day and I was just still am actually so tired and everything is just freaking me out and making me emotional and yeah I'm just everything is just so stressful today so yeah I want to go to sleep early working on this W design and I needed to somehow mathematically calculate the white spaces between the letters so that it, you know, has some sense and is working. But I have just no freaking idea how to do that and I've been struggling with that today during my typography class and the teachers just told me to have fun and not to struggle, but have fun instead with that and play with it. I mean, thank you so much for such a nice advice, but I have literally no idea how to do that. And so now I just have this and I think I'm just gonna, you know, submit that. I don't really care at this point. I still need to come up with one more triplex and I have 50 minutes left, so this will have to do the trick. Okay, so I came up with these three designs, um, but the first one is very similar to the CD design. My teachers already accepted, so yeah, that's why I didn't really develop this one. Then I had this Y and V, which I don't know how well that is working. And then finally, I have this G and J design, which I really like, actually. I mean, I like how this dot is working with, like, this here. 
but I'm not sure what the teachers are going to say. But yeah, I'm going to just quickly prepare that and submit it. I have four minutes. Okay, finally submitting that. Actually, I think I'm going to sleep now. It's almost 1 a.m. Um, I did not work on my animation because I started um, texting my friend and yeah, we're just talking. But it doesn't look that bad. I mean, I'll show it to my teacher and yeah, after his approval, I'll just work on more details and something because I could like work on it now, but it just doesn't really make sense. I mean, I will be sleep deprived and dead tomorrow. And I already suffered today from not sleeping enough. So I think I don't want to repeat that tomorrow. Here is what I have as of right now. Um, it's not that yellow in real life as on the recording, but yeah. So it's supposed to be an explosion. I mean, it's not that great, but <laughs> yeah, that's that's what I'm working with. Last week I didn't go to university on Wednesday, so I was absent in my graphic design class and the teachers have just sent us an email saying that we have to submit the final versions of the pictograms today. I think everyone is just trying to get us to submit everything before Christmas break. Since I was absent, I didn't get the critique on my pictograms that I did. So I'll show them today, hopefully they will be fine. Um, I tried working on some more pictograms this morning, but I didn't have enough time to work them out and calculate what types of triangles I wanted to use. So I just, you know, left that and hopefully the pictograms with the heads will be fine. I did three versions, I think. Yeah, that's what the teachers told me two weeks ago to do. Um, so yeah, we'll see what they say. In my graphic design class, we were discussing our pictograms and yeah, we were just doing a critique with the whole group. And we also talked about um, the graphic design market and looking for a job and everything. So it was really nice to have this discussion with the professors and the whole group. animation class I just went for a critique of my 2D animation and then we had a lecture about Oscar rewarded animated movies. It was quite fun actually. Uh, we didn't manage to go through all of the movies that the professor prepared for us so I think we'll continue this lecture after Christmas as well. Hi, it's almost 9 p.m. I'm now starting to work on my composition assignment. I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. I just created this mood board and then I wanted to somehow incorporate flowers to my portraits and I don't know yet what I'm going to create but I have to do something because I need to show it to my teachers tomorrow. <laughs> I think I'll just scan some more flowers because I found some free vector images of flowers online, but I have some of my own flowers at home, so I'll scan them and see what I can do with it. Then I'll just let you know how it's turned out. It's 11 p.m. 
I have some hot chocolate that my brother made and I'm working on these portraits but it's just not turning out well. I wanted to somehow incorporate the flowers in the skin but it's just, I don't know, I don't really know how I'm supposed to do that. And yeah, basically I have no idea what I'm doing. It's not really working out. I don't know. I don't know what I sh should do. And also I'm watching Gossip Girl. I've already watched two episodes. Yeah, it's it's cool, but I I don't have much time today because I don't want to go to sleep very late because tomorrow I have a drawing class. We're drawing a model and she's coming to us to, you know, model. And I have to finish the drawing, so I need to have some energy for that. So I'll probably go to sleep. Maybe at midnight I'll just finish the work so I have one hour and then I'll just get ready for going to sleep and that will give me like seven-ish hours of no six six hours of sleep maybe like six and something but I'll probably go to sleep past 1 a.m. so I finished working on the portrait for today it's 1 a.m. and I'm just going to quickly go take a shower and go to sleep I like it more than I did in the beginning I still don't know what direction I'm supposed to take I wanted the flowers that I use in each portrait to represent the time and the age but they just don't really look like pressed flowers or dried flowers I don't really know how to get that effect I don't know, maybe just all of them will have flowers in their skin I don't know But that's it, I'm going to show that to my teachers for critic tomorrow And, and yeah, and that's it for today <laughs> past nine I've just woken up um, from a two-hour nap because I was just so tired <laughs> I don't really know why after school I went to work and then I went to church and then I was working on this card game it's something like we're not really strangers but in Polish I'm making it for me and my friends and yeah, I I just worked on it for like half an hour and then I was just so tired that I decided to lay in bed and take a nap and the nap lasted two hours. I don't really know what to do right now because I didn't manage to get the critique for my portraits for my composition class today because the teachers had like a meeting or something and only three people managed to get the critique and I was like sixth or seventh in line so yeah I it there was enough time for me so I'm going tomorrow and I was thinking that maybe I can work on another portrait so that tomorrow I can show two things but I don't really know. I I don't have the energy to do that. Maybe I should go to sleep actually. It will probably take me like over an hour to get ready to go to sleep. So I'll go to sleep at midnight. So that will be cool. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'm not doing anything today. <laughs> I'm recording it for the second time because I always forget that whenever I'm holding my phone in my hand to record something it's always so shaky and hence I'm now recording it with it on my desk. Today is the last day of art school before Christmas 
and I'm so happy that Christmas break is finally here. I'm so happy for Christmas and I'm also happy that it's the last day of art school because even though it's really enjoyable and fun sometimes, it's also very demanding and exhausting and yeah, it's making me sleep deprived, so that's why I'm happy. Also, another thing is that I'm kind of sad that I cannot wear whatever I kind of want today because I have a painting class and so there is a possibility that my clothes will get damaged because of the paint and yeah I wanted to wear a cute outfit with this sweater and a skirt but I'm not wearing the skirt because I like it too much and I'm wearing just simple black pants instead and I'm going to take off the sweater for um, painting and put on, put on my painting shirt instead so it's only a halfly cute outfit I mean the upper part of the outfit is cute um, for half of the day because on the other half I have um, a printmaking class in which I'm just going to sketch um, yeah but for the first part I'm not going to be in my sweater so yeah that's how it is sometimes when you don't want to ruin and damage your clothes in my painting class i was painting my still nature it's a monochrome painting and i'm doing it in this pinkish reddish colors and the teacher said it's okay all right and We'll continue working on that for one more uh, lesson after Christmas. So I'm glad it was not that bad. In the beginning, when I saw the painting after painting it last week, I was kind of terrified because I didn't really know what to do with it. And I didn't know what path to take with painting it and whether it's all right or not and I was very unsure about it but then the teacher said it's actually all right and I can just keep painting and yeah that, that was a relief <laughs> then I went to get critique for my composition assignment for the portraits with flowers and the teachers didn't really like or I don't even know how to say that but my vision was not necessarily their vision and they told me to just take another approach to that assignment and maybe be a little bit more experimental and bold and just do something different than just putting flowers on the face so i'll have to figure out what to do but it also gave me some useful pieces of advice like regarding composition and how I want to portray the models because this is a series of four portraits so they need to go well together and I think I'll retake the pictures but it's fine my printmaking class which was really chill we were just drinking tea eating gingerbread cookies and tangerines and everyone was just talking and we were sketching in the meantime because I'm working on this new etching project so I was just doing some sketches and then I went for a critic and once approved I need to re-sketch that during this uh, Christmas break, but other than that, it's uh, all right. And then me and my friend um, stayed for a little bit to talk with the teacher about art, aesthetics, beauty in art and the studies and basically everything. And it was a really insightful conversation. And now I'm home. I'm going to uh, rate mass in half an hour. And then I don't know, I think I will just get ready and start 
preparing for Christmas. So that was the vlog. Thank you so much for watching and spending this last week before Christmas break with me. Don't forget to sign up to my newsletter. I'm going to send out the first email in January, just right after the new year. And also if you sign up, you'll get this strawberry phone wallpapers. So that's another reason why you should sign up. And yeah, have a wonderful Christmas. And I will see you. Oh, I don't I don't really know if I'm going to manage to put this video out before Christmas. So have a wonderful new year and whatever time you're watching this. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!